due to, due to the amount of noise that's going to be caused from the compressor and the vacuum, I'm not going to be able to talk very clearly. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to explain to you what I'm going to do, and then we're going to stop the video, and then we're going to just show you it without any talking. Uh, basically, I'm going to heat it in my heat gun on high, and then I'm going to take, and I'm going to do the one side with the green. I'm going to go back to my heat and heat it again, but I'm, then I'm just going to quickly switch to the other jar of the candy pink. I'm going to spray the other side. <laughs> I'm going to spray the other side with the candy pink. Go back to my heat gun. And then I'm going to use this template right here that I showed before in a previous video that has little dots on it. I'm going to set that on. I'm going to put the black dots on. Go back to my heat and we'll be complete at that point. finished product, the watermelon spoon. Now you want to cure this in your oven after you're done, uh, 15 minutes, approximately 350. And you've got a spoon that will withstand pike or salmon or whatever because it's powder paint and it will not chip and it won't scrape off.